Hey everybody, the Gaming Guru 51 here, and welcome back for more of The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess Blind. In the last episode, we made a delivery to a lazy Goron who needed hot spring water, and I have to say, that was awful. A freaking train wreck at its finest. In this episode, actually, no, I'll just do it this way. We're going to warp, and where are we going to warp? We're going to warp to Zoro's Domain, because that is where this red target is found. And I think, what was her name? Ashe? Is that who was here? Yeah. Uh, we're going to a new area in this episode. I have no idea what to expect. But for the name of Snow Peak Mountains, I'm assuming it's a snowy area. So let's go ahead and go this way. Actually, you know what? There's one thing I've always wanted to do before we went anywhere. Hold on, let me transform to a human. Once I get out of there, freaking, yeah. I want to light up these freaking lanterns, man. I want to see if there's anything I get out of them. Just while I'm here. Because they look like I get something out of them if I light them off. And I don't know how many there are. There's probably just these two. But I want to see. Yeah! 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 Okay! After all the times we've been here, I've never once thought to do this. Yeah, call me crazy. Alright, let's put this away. Let's go ahead and put on the iron... Oh, you know, what, why am I doing? I need to put on the iron boots. I know, I know, this will take a little bit of time to do, but I really want to see what's in the shadow chest, which is actually right over here. Oh, and I have, I have a limited amount of time, but don't worry. Uh, did we get a piece of heart out of this? What do we get? What do we get? Ooh, we got a purple rupee! And actually, with that, what am I doing? No, I understand that. Take these off. Wait, take these off. Jeez. Oh, no, 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 where am I going? No, 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 Thank you. Uh, okay. After that delay, we are going to go to where that red target is. Oh, my God. I just... All right. Now, I think I... I was on to saying something. Now that we have enough money, we can actually go back to Kakariko any time to get the... Give the money to the Goron. That's what I was trying to say. I must have cleared my thought. Oh, my God. I'm dropping down. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, that was a fun drop. Alright, so red target. I'm gonna go over here and save to assume it's this way, right? Yeah, yeah. Wait, wasn't this place iced up before? I remember it was when we first came here. Snow Peak is up ahead. It's very treacherous. Not only has the weather been bad lately, but because the beast has been coming into the village, we have been taking extra precautions. What? What beast? I, I don't even know what you're talking about. <laughs> Anyways, let's go ahead and go this way, because we haven't been this way yet. I don't even know, man. Okay, what are we what are we gonna get? Oh my. Very peaceful music, and here we are in Snow Peak. Just the music, man. So soothing. And what the hell? Link. Oh, hey, it is you, Ashe. What brings you to a dangerous place like this? Ever since Zora's domain got covered in ice, this mountain's been much colder than usual, yeah? Not only that, but I heard a really weird story from the Zoras. Apparently, the beast that lives somewhere on this mountain has been seen frequently in Zora's domain. I was curious, so I came and visited, and as they said, a giant appeared. Yeah, it looked like this. You got Ashe sketched. This hastily drawn picture shows the creature Ashe saw holding a red fish. Show it to people. Yeah, yeah, do that. And you might get some information. Apparently, this thing's been stealing red fish from the village. I want to investigate further, but I can't even see the path through this blizzard, yeah? I'm sure you're here because you're curious about the mountain, but you best not go without a plan. Wait, what? We can't go this way? We can't? I I'm going. To I'm going this way. I don't care. Yeah, I, I I can walk down here just fine. I don't understand. Um. All right, so let's go see where we can go. Right? Yeah. We seem to be doing just fine, right? Yeah, we can go this way. Just look at this. We're doing just fine, actually. I don't know. I'm assuming. Uh, what's the matter if we fall in the ice? Yeah, you freeze to death. It's freezing ice water, and you're expecting not to die? <laughs> Man.
man, we're just crazy. But yeah, what do you mean best not go without a plan? We seem to be, we can see, we, we can walk on this ice. I mean, if we're not supposed to go this way, they would probably be like, oh, I don't know, like a meter would happen if we get too cold or something. We seem to, I don't know, well, we're, this is fine. Let's keep going, shall we? Okay, oh god, we have enemies. Um, this is not good. We can't do anything. We, this is, alright, this is not working. Um, yeah, this ain't gonna work. Let's go back. Okay, we're gonna die too. Minda, what do you have to tell me? What a terrible storm. Looks like you're not welcome here. Look, I understand that the mirror is hidden somewhere in this mountain, but we need a plan. I know, that story that Ash had told about the beast. What do you think about that? You think we should go show that sketch to the Zora and see what they have to say? Okay, that's that makes sense. Alright, we're gonna warp. We're getting out of this freezing wasteland. We are going to Zora's Domain once again. Alright, Minda, take us away, because I do not want to be here anymore. It's a pretty scary place. I mean, what, how would you feel if you were trapped in a freaking snowy, icy wasteland in the middle of nowhere? You're guaranteed to die. And it's just, it's, that's just sad, thinking about that, now that I think about it. Okay, what I want to do now, I want to go, yeah, I'm losing sense of direction here. I want to go this way, and turn back into a human, and I guess we're going to do exactly what we're told. Show the pictures, show the sketch to the Zoras, and see what they have to say about it. Hmm. Alright, Zora, we'll start with you, since we're here. What do you got to say about this sketch? This, did you draw this? The beast. Hey, isn't it holding a red fish? That's a reek fish. Okay, so the fish that the beast was holding is a reek fish. Alright, what do you have to tell me, sir? The fish that beast has. Prince Rallis is quite skilled at catching this type of fish. Oh, Prince, where could you be by now? Hmm, what a sad dude, that's sad. Losing their king and all. When I see this fish, I can't help think of the prince. Yeah, that's sad. Let me guess, are you going to tell me the exact same thing? You got different things. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Uh, how about you? Anything special? Reekfish live closer to two stone formations we call the mother and child rocks. They've got a distinct smell that's... they got a distinct smell that some find a little... oh my god. they got a distinct smell that some find a little gamey, but they're packed with nutrients so they're revered and well cared for. <laughs> I can't read. And I'm going to assume I... Yeah, I figured I can't do that. I can't bring it to the water. Where am I supposed to go now? I guess we're going to go try back down here and try talking to more of the Zoras and see what they got to say about this. Um, so far, we haven't really gotten any lead as to where we're supposed to go right now. But I'm sure I'll find it. All we know is that the fish is a reek fish and that they're found in the mother and child rocks. What the hell is that? What's a mother and child rock? Uh, maybe one of these Zoras can help? Preferably? That would be the best thing. Alright, we'll start with you first. Yeah, you're gonna tell me the exact same thing, and what about you? Anything? Please? Hey, the beast of Snow Peak. Oh, the redfish is holding. That's a reekfish. No dip. Ah, so the beast has been showing itself because it's been catching weak fish. We didn't think that anyone besides Prince Rallis was capable of catching this type of fish. Huh. What am I supposed to do? Prince Rallis was... is dead, right? Yeah, he was... he can catch freak fish. I don't know. I honestly don't know. Um, did any of these Zoras give us a hint? Um, let's go ahead and try to talk to him. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, I'm really stumped as to what I'm supposed to do here. A suspicious girl has been seen around the area. I do not know what you're talking about. Uh, let's try talking to this person. Apparently, the beast of Snow Peak Mountain has been appearing in this town frequently of late. Why the beast normally is on Snow Peak comes down to the village? Well, we don't have a clue as to why this would be. Okay. <gasps> oh my god! I just thought of something! We're going back to Kakariko. Okay. Oh, crap. I know exactly where we're supposed to go. 
I know. We're, they're, they're, come on, I want to warp! Come on. Ah! I'm leaving the freaking Zoro's domain then. You know what? How about down here? Okay. Kakariko Village! R R Prince Rallis's mother. That's found in Kakariko Village, right? Oh, uh, that grove. Is that where we're supposed to go right now? Is that the mother and child rocks? I, I don't know. And that's where Prince Rallis... That's where her mother lives. His mother. Oh my god, I'm a genius. Oh my god, I just thought of this. Oh my god. Alright, let's go transform to a human. Actually, while we're here in Kakariko Village, we can give the money to the Goron. Oh wait, but it's probably closed, isn't it? Is it closed right now? Please. Not ah, crap. Yeah, it's closed. Um, alright. So the grove. That's in the graveyard, right? Oh my god, I, I just thought about that. What better answer to, than to go to the freaking grove? Oh my god, I, I feel like a genius. Oh my gosh. Okay, does that... Please tell me that's where I need to go. That would be the greatest. <gasps> and here's a Poe. Yes, while we're here, we might as well catch you. Come here, Poe. Come here. Alright, let's go ahead and finish you off. And this is, I think, our 13th pole soul. Correct? Is that correct? Yes. Alright, let's go ahead and transform to a human and go to the grove. Oh my god. Please. Let that be where we need to go. That would be the best thing ever. Alright. Let's go. Oh my god. I, I, I feel so smart right now. I'm going to feel really dumb. This is not where I'm supposed to go, though. Yeah, there's somebody here, right? Hello. Is is your name Link? My mother came to me in a dream. She showed me your image. She spoke of a youth who would save our domain and steer my fate. One named Link. I must thank you for all you've done. If there's anything I can ever do for you, please tell me. Please. Actually, there is something I kind of want to know. This. Hmm, the beast made out of the snowy mountain, perhaps? But more important is this redfish it is holding. It must be a reek fish. That is a rare specimen found only in the Zora village. It feeds on a valuable type of coral, and without that bait, even our best fishers cannot catch one. Look closely, Link. My earring is made of this coral. I would like to give it to you. You got the coral earring. It's made of precious coral from Zora's domain. It is in the shape of a hit fish hook. It's lovely. It's been added as a hook for your fishing rod. With this, you can now catch reek fish. I received it from my mother, but it is fine. I no longer need it. As I look at you, I get a sense of what my mother wanted, what I should be doing now. I will return to my village. Wait. The reek fish can be found near the mother and child rocks in the waterfall basin near my village. Oh, so it's not there in the waterfall basin. The fish are red, so I think you should be able to spot them. Wait, so here is not it? Wait, I th wait, what? I thought you were you're not dead. Oh no, the mother's dead. He's not dead. The mother is. Oh, I'm dumb. Oh. The mother's dead! He's still alive! Oh! The beast of snow peak took. Maybe if we took a look at it, we'd give us a clue. Wait, can you- Wait, I honestly didn't register what you just said. Okay. Oh my god, I feel like a dunce! Oh! Near his village. Oh, I feel so dumb. Alright, we are going to Zora's Domain. I, I- Wait, wait, whoa, whoa, I, did I see another red Oh my god, I'm- No, 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 I'm dumb. <laughs> the, 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 the child's not dead, you idiot. The mother is- Oh, I'm so dumb. Hold on a second, though. Alright, so... What a- I need to see the map. Yeah, I saw this, and I was like, oh, crap. But then I realized it wasn't really anything at all. 
Wait, so the it's near the waterfall basin of your village? Is that what you said? It is. I think. I'm gonna, I, I honestly don't even know. <laughs> Alright, so let's go this way. And tr maybe try to catch a damn one of these. Is it here? The, you said the waterfall basin. What's the waterfall basin? Is it here? Oh my god. Zora's River. Zora's Domain. Yeah, it's here. I'm sure of that. But where's the mother and child rocks again? Oh, I think I see one, right? No, I'm dumb. Am I dumb? I probably am. You said near a... Oh, this must be it, right? Uh, fishing rod. I guess I'm gonna try to hunt one of these damn things. Am I even fishing in the right spot? Okay, I caught something. Did I catch one? Hey! That's a reek fish! You can see fish you've caught. Yeah! What do I do with it? Oh, I could probably put it in the bottle, can I not? Hmm. Bottle? I do have an empty bottle. No, it... We're... No! Actually, you know what? I probably want to catch one over here. Because that way I can, I guess I can bring it to Snowhead. Or Snow Peak. Snowhead? Am I dumb? Oh my god, I'm stupid. Alright, let's try to catch one up here again. Alright. Holy cow, I'm so dumb. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, let's catch one of these fish again. Okay, so we got a reek fish. We got another one. <laughs> it's called a reek fish because it's reeks. That's funny. All right. Can I like catch it? Like, what do I do with it? What do I do with it? I took a look at it. Yeah, I would love to if I knew what to do with it. Okay, so we got another one. But what do I do with it? It reeks. Wait, I can go where to see where I cut the fish? The fish journal? Reek fish. Okay. I'm taking a look at it right now. I don't know what to do with it. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do with it. I don't know. Oh, I just noticed that it gives off a freaking scent like that. Oh my god, am I stupid? Sniff. Oh my god. Forget the po- Yes. You learned the reek fish scent. Okay, that gives me a clue. Oh, I, I feel like a dummy. I feel so dumb. It, I, it, I saw that three different times again while I'm but I'm like, I, I didn't notice. Oh, I don't want to go up there again. Let's go. Oh, my God. Wait. Did I, okay. Um, we're going up this way. Oh, I feel like a dumbass. Really? All right. It ends here? Does it go down? Does it? Oh, it totally does. Actually, you know what? We're actually going to follow the scent next time. Yeah, I'm a jerk. I'm a jerk. Yeah. I, I feel dumb. And I had a long day of school today. Not that as an excuse or anything. No. I'm just kind of burned out at the moment. Uh, we're going to take... Or I'm going to end the episode off here. Next time on Twilight Princess Blind, we are going to look... And follow the scent of the reek fish and see what lies ahead of us in Snowhead. S Snow Peak! Snow Peak! Anyways, with that being said, thank you guys so very much for watching. And I will see you next time for more Twilight Princess Blind.